This is the outside. This is the dining room. Nice hardwood floors. This is the formal living room. This is the kitchen. Nice island. Pantry. Gas stove. And then you have like, I guess they would call it the family room. I'm gonna stand back here so you can see the full effect. So you can see it's very open here. Here is the master, same hardwood floors. You have a tray ceiling. You could easily fit a king size bed there if you want to, two nightstands. And then there's plenty of extra space here. And then here is the master bathroom. Tile floors, double vanity. A soaker tub, stand up shower, and this is your closet. Here you can probably see the ceiling's just a little bit better. So, this direction you have a half bath. have a nice laundry room with a storage unit which is nice for cleaners and everything in the laundry room just so you know where we're at again there is the master family room and kitchen we're gonna go upstairs you have nice open area up here we call that a loft and you have four more bedrooms upstairs and two full baths so this is the loft area if you go this direction it's one of the bedrooms closet this is the bathroom that these bedrooms could share. And then here is the second bedroom up here. All these rooms would easily hold a queen size bed, deep closet. This would be the third bedroom up here. And all the bedrooms up here, which is nice, are all about the same size. So there'd be no arguing over space. And then you have a linen closet. So you have a two car garage that I'm gonna show you. a covered patio you can put a couple of tables and chairs and there's not a whole lot of yard back here for mowing but you do have a little bit of green space And this is your two car garage. Well, there's extra space on the side of it to put like a refrigerator. And then upstairs here, if you ever wanted to finish it out, 